Over the next few videos, I'll demonstrate how to program circular pockets, such as the ones shown in this turkey call. Before starting a part such as this, a hole is often drilled so the tool does not have to plunge directly into the solid material, but instead can feed into the pre-drilled hole. For this part, I'll first pre-drill a 3 quarter inch hole, and then I'll use a 1 inch end mill to rough out the 3 and a half inch pocket to the 1 8 inch depth. Since I'm only making a few parts, I'll use the same tool to rough and finish it. First, I'll put the tool in the spindle and position over the center of the part and then feed it to depth. Now I need to calculate how many cuts and what the step over will be. To do that, I'll first calculate how much material is to be removed. Since I have pre-drilled a 3 quarter inch hole and the final part diameter will be 3 half inches, there is 1.375 inches of material to be removed on each side of the hole. I would like to take a final pass of between 25 and 75 thou and would like the cutter to use approximately 70% of its diameter on each cut. If I leave 75 thou for the final pass, then there will be 1.3 inches of material to remove with my roughing cuts. I'm using a 1 inch cutter, so if I take two rough passes of 0.65, this will use 65% of the cutter. For this part, I want to program the cutter center. When the cutter plunges down on the center of the part, it will open up the 3 quarter hole to 1 inch, with 1 eighth of material being removed radially from the hole. In order to make the first pass remove 0.65, the cutter will need to move over 0.525. To program this, I'll code a counterclockwise arc incrementally, which sweeps through 180 degrees. So I'll enter G91, G03, X minus 0.525 and I minus 0.2625. Then I'll program a full circle by just programming the I 0.525. Next I'll code X minus 0.65, I minus 0.325 to arc into the next cut, followed by I 1.175 to cut the second rough pass. To code the third and final cut for this 3.5 inch diameter, I'll enter X minus 0.075, I minus 0.0375 to arc into the cut, and I 1.25 to take the final pass. Lastly, I'll code G90, X0, Y0, I 0.625 to arc the cutter back to the center. In the next video, I'll demonstrate how to cut the 3.375 hole using helical milling.